Mm -hmm. So we left off with him going, give that back, Yashiro. Ah. Boom. She decides to eat it. <laughs> Explain it. Wakata, wakata. I understand. And now, Archie, you have this super long line. <laughs> Ooh, fun. Um, so no, um, uroko? Yes, uroko. Um, okay, I'll read the whole thing. Uh, onaji ningyo kara toreta uroko o nonda. Nonda mono doshi wa osoroshi noroi o ukere kawari ni. Hey. So it's easiest when we split this off into smaller bits. So an uroko looks a little bit like this, and we can see, see quite a few of them on her tail fin. Ah, scales. Yes. So, sorry, what ningyo no uroko? What does that mean? Uh, ningyo is doll, right? So ningyo can mean doll, but it would have different kanji. This Actually, has hito and um, sakana. Okay, so mermaid, I'm guessing from the picture. It does mean mermaid. So, that is a mermaid scale. And now we're talking about. Um, So from it's the uh, I I'll just explain what this part means. So it's kind of hard. It's basically um so a scale that was taken from the same um mermaid if like um some similar person, like a similar fellow to them, decided to eat that say that scale, then a terrible curse would be um, sent to them. However, we have the kawarini being um, as a replacement for. So it's basically saying that if you eat this scale, you will receive a horrible um, curse unless um, a comrade of the, of the original goldfish also eats it like as a like, I'll eat this as well type of thing. Um, so rather than a curse, what you receive is um, this. It's a Just so you know, by kyoryoku, it is not this kyoryoku, which is pronounced the same way, but has a different kanji characters. Uh, oh boy, I'm just scrambling through the spreadsheet at this point. <laughs> <laughs> um, so hijo, um, I believe uh -huh. we have like uh like a strain, like a bimyo, like uh chikara. So <laughs> it's not right. um normal. Mm. Uh, extraordinary is the word, or unusual. Kyoryoku. What does that mean? Um, it has chikara in it. And I think, yeah, and tsuyoi. So like a strong power. Yes, exactly. Kyoryoku. Uh, 
there's a word that's pronounced exactly the same with the different countries I had over there earlier, which means to work right. together. <laughs> uh, this one is um, strong power. Now, N, do you remember what N meant? Um, I remember seeing it in N Musubi. Is it was in there, yes. So yeah. we have it now separated out of the compound sentence into its almost like direct meaning. So the compound word has a little bit of a different meaning than um, it separated out. So mm -hmm. N has multiple meanings. It can mean the bonds you have between people or like fate or destiny. And musubi means like to tie something. So. Mm -hmm. In this case, a strange um, power um, ties you together with somebody else in some kind of bond. Gotcha. And Yashiro goes, ooh, I like that. <laughs> so if, um, so we have this, this scale. If me and I'm a comrade of somebody eat it, then we'll both get a um, bond together. Sorry, like this stuff right here is kind of like iffy. I think I'll re look at <laughs> exactly what that's saying. Cause I'm like, I'm trying to explain it, but like it sounds weird. Um, he's like, oh my goodness, why did you do that? Ore no mo nante no ware no ware no um, So he's like, I just said that if you did something like eating it, you'll be cursed. E, that's that's fine. Eh? That's fine. That's fine. Um, and Archie, what is this? Um, it's really tiny. <laughs> no, it's the name of the senpai, which is like Mina. Oh, the oh right, senpai. Of course, Minamoto. I guess right. Minamoto senpai to, uh. Remember, you can always break things up into smaller bits. Um Right. So, um, so Ryo Omo was the like the mutual love with Minamoto Senpai yeah. in order to like become that or like for it to happen. Yes. Um Noro... so do you know what um no roi means i think that would be in the the deck oops no roi was that the one we saw on the previous page or it's the word we saw on the previous stage no you'll be cursed right okay yes yeah, so um then we have the temo and do you know what temo does um but right it's not but demo is but but temo when it's used with um verbs has a different special meaning and i, I believe you've done it before it's the um the, the uh what's it what's it called uh the even if kind of meaning it's a it's a the example so even if I am cursed, then E. Okay, so even if I'm cursed, it's okay if I have the mutual love with Minamoto Senpai. Exactly. Nani yo dogu mo terun janai, which is what are you doing? Obviously, you're you have a do you had a tool on you. Hanako-san no usotsuki, which is Hanako-san, you liar. Liar. Yatto michikita. 
I finally found him. Demo Masaka. No way. There's no way. And Archie. Let's do this whole thing. Um, Masaka. Ano, ano. Um, Minamoto kun, watashi ichinen no toki kara zutto ski deshita. Um, so Minamoto kun, I like from first, from my first years, uh, have completely liked you. Exactly. Perfect. So obviously she's doing a confession thing. She has a red red face and her legs are nice and skinny. <laughs> so yeah. Um damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. No, no, senpai. Uh, which is, you know, obviously that's bad. Stop it, senpai. No. Uh chotto na no ni. Even though in just a little bit, I would have, you know, been able to use my curse item on him. Go man. I'm sorry. And Archie, what do you guys see? Uh, Boku Sukina Koga Irunba. Sorry about that. Um, <laughs> uh, so I, I already have someone that I like. Perfect. Girl that I and like. why don't you do the next one as well? It's pretty related. Uh, so for a long time I've liked her, or like for, for a long time back. Mm -hmm. Um Doshtemo Sonoko Janaito Dakara Gomenne. Um, what does sono koja nai mean? So, like, that's not the girl? Yes. So, with the toll, we're kind of adding a kind of if statement almost. Um, it's not always an if statement because if statements, when statements, and whatever are all kind of looser in Japanese. Uh, mm -hmm. So it's in this case, if would be would be fine. Um, so if it's not that girl, then dot dot dot. He trails off. He doesn't really like totally complete this. So so because of this, go minute. So he's basically saying it's impossible. I can't. If it's not the girl I like, then I can't. You know, date you. I'm sorry. Yeah. So sorry. Uh, senpai, skina hito itanda. Which wow, senpai had someone he liked. And Archie, kore. Uh, demo, demo kore ga areba sonna koto kankei nai nai shi. You can kind of ignore the she here. Um, so this demo, you knew it earlier. What's this guy? But. Exactly. And what is the kore referring to? Kore ga areba. Um, kore ga areba. <laughs> <laughs> but similar idea, a little different. This so is a this true if statement. Demo koreba, korega areba. Um, if this is there, so like if the scale, yes, mermaid scale is yeah. there. Yes. In this case, it kind of means like if I have this in the context. Mm -hmm. So um, uh, that won't be a relationship. Basically, so kanke 
means relationship, but not as in dating somebody relationship. It's talking about a relationship between two things. Like, are they correlated almost? Uh, Um, So there's no relation at all between whether or not Senpai likes somebody if I use this. Like, it, it won't be into the formula of things. Right. So it's that form of relationship. Um, you can use it for like, um, I'm involved with somebody, but it doesn't mean like to be in a relationship. It just to be involved with is kind of what it means. Yeah. So anybody's good then? That such a thing like that. Yeah. Which is, oh my goodness, what is this? Why? Okay. Oops. Boop. Okay. So first is these guys. Archie. Uh, nande, nande konna koto ni, uh, na chatta no. So, why, why is this happening, I guess, or? Yes. That is exactly what it's saying. The like, konna koto is like such a thing happening, and mm. the chatta is like completely happening. <laughs> so it's just like, it's very much just like stressing that more. Watashi ana ni gabatta no ni chigao, which is even though I tried so hard, wait, that's wrong. Otondo hanashita koto mo nai, namai o oboite morao to mo shinakatta. Which is, I never really even talked to this guy, which is her first love. And she mm-hmm. didn't even have the decency <laughs> to um, remember his name of my name, Minato Senpai. Remember, she doesn't know his first name. And what is this, Archie? Uh- so now, you know, because you'll try your best. So, ima does mean now, but what does made mean? How is that different from kara? Um, like from now versus. And like until now. So yeah, one of them is from and one of them is until. Made is the until. So it's basically Mm -hmm. saying up to now, you have done your best. You've done your best. Rather than from now on, it doesn't mean that. He's saying Mm -hmm. until now. And she goes, Gambatta te nani o, which is I tried my best with what? And um, Archie, onigashimasu. Um, Kento Chikai no Toriokuste, uh, Mokuare de Omoikonde. So, um, I think. Um, yeah, you start with what does kento chigai mean? Kento. Kento chigai. So chigai is like incorrect or wrong. Yes. So kento is probably like not. Real or it's a good guess. So kinko kinko to guy kind of means like some it, like making a wrong guess. So mm. she's like she makes she has an idea in her head and she and it's wrong. There's something false about it. Mm-hmm. And based off of this, she do ryoku. What does that mean? Um.
登力して。What is the, the last part of the kanji tell us about this? So, like power. So, it's some form of power. Doryoku means to put effort into something. Okay. So, this right here means she put a whole lot of effort. But mm. it was based off of a like false idea, a like strange thought. So if you remember a while ago, she doesn't actually like Minato Senpai or something like that. She she just wants to like to date him for the purpose of like pushing uh like in front of some other guy's face or whatever. So like she mm. kind of has this like weird idea that she's not really thinking about the person she likes. She just kind of goes, I'll I'll go over and be cute. Give him some flowers and he'll date me. And then, and then we can just show off to everybody. I'll have a boyfriend. Like that. It's kind of like a mistaken idea that she's just putting a lot of effort into. And um, about this, kind of, <laughs> it's like, uh, he, um, you know what um, omoi konde means? It's a nice little compound word from omo. And Mm -hmm. um to like believe right um not or... exactly so omo does mean to believe and mm -hmm. the konde part has lots of like little like metaphorical parts of it so konde mm -hmm. is a very common compound word to be added to things that kind of means to it it directly means to like stuff into something so it's so in this case it's like your thoughts are like shoved into yourself. So it's kind of just like being like self-absorbed kind of in your thoughts. Mm -hmm. Like you're full of this thought and only like this thought kind of. And the thing that she is thinking of basically is mukuwareru. You know what that means? Um... to be re to like get I think it means to like get something yes it it's it means to um like to receive something from it like in um uh, yeah I'll look at the direct things I'm like I, I when I heard it I was thinking um <laughs> like you're a good girl eco eco kind of like mm. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's to be rewarded. rewarded by. It's just like so. She's she she just was like absorbed with the idea that she would be rewarded for doing these random things of like making myself look cute, whatever. That she put up cause, just because she put effort into it. So mm -hmm. she she's not thinking at all about the guy she likes. She just is like, I will grow plants. <laughs> Obviously, that will get me a boyfriend. And she just kind of does that rather than going, oh, what is Minato Senpai like as a person? Oh, maybe I should talk with Minato Senpai, learn his name, you know, make myself yeah. an actual person in his life. She doesn't do that. She just goes, eh, I'll, I'll cook a little bit. That's good enough for me. And then she goes, um, konna mono ni na, konna mono ni made tayotte. Which um, means uh, the fact that I relied it relied on stuff to this extent. Um, well, to this thing, not like this extent. Like, <laughs> so the fact that I relied on this, I've been just like thinking about myself. So she's being selfish, basically. Um, and the konamono has the kanji for kai, which means like ghost. So it's just giving us an insinuation that the fact he like went to Hanako-san to rely on him and then also mm -hmm. this like magical thin thing, uh, scale thing. It's very like the fact he relied on like weird magic stuff rather than, you know, talking to me, Mato senpai <laughs> And jigo jitoku da, which is you reap what you sow, um, zenbu. So all of this is just payment for something that I did wrong. Or a mistake I made. Mitsuketa, I found you. Kore, kore wa mizu. 
This this is water and Archie. When you guys see us. Abunai, abunai. Um, ato ato chotto de hikara biru toko datta yo. So hira biru toko means to dry up, and it was not in the vocab list. I don't know why they assumed we'd know that word. <laughs> Um, Kanako san is talking. Abunai, abunai. Oh, danger, danger. Exactly. Ato chotto. So, ato as in ato de. Kind of, no ato. A little, a little bit. Yes. Or. So, ato chotto de, which is in just a little bit more time, if that occurred. Hira. Hikara biru koto datta yo. This is why it's abunai. Um, this is a little bit easier if you see the context. So suddenly she's been dropped inside water. Kore wa mizu. And then Hanako san says, Oh, that was dangerous. You almost dried up. Just in a little bit, you would have been completely dried up. Isn't that weird? <laughs> Abunai, abunai. Um, Wait, who's, who's drying up? <laughs> Where is that? Uh, Yashiro-san. Ya ah. Yashiro so in the last slide, we see that something's going on with Yashiro. The, 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 she's being like cursed or something. Mm. She's like rowing like fins or something like that. So Hanako's saying, oh, you almost dried up right there. Ooh, that would have been bad. <laughs> Uh, and then Yashiro thinks, Iki ga dekiru Hanako san, which is, I'm able to breathe. So she wasn't able to breathe now, possibly before. Mm. Um, and she goes, Oh, it's Hanako san and um, Archie, this one. Uh, Yashiro no tame ni iro iro yoi shita, yoi shita da ze, uh, kini te. Do you know what tame means? So for, for Yashiro's sake, or like, um, Iro Iro, um, so like many, many like good things. Hi, hi, hi. What I'm doing probably won't help. <laughs> <laughs> you kind of have to like know, like I am circling things to yoista, but like that's more, it's more of the iro iro, I guess. <laughs> um, yoista um... means to prepare something. For somebody. Ah, uh, okay. So he's saying, Oh, I prepared a whole bunch of stuff for you, such as this nice little water underwater cottage. So nice. <laughs> yes, you know? um, so since he did this, mm -hmm. which is for so me. I'm giving so much of care. Mm. I, I um, care so much, and so you're. You should be happy. Kind of. So, kiniite means to like something in a non romantic way. It, it just means to be interested, like, oh, I like this. So, he's saying, if you were able to um, like this thing that I gave you, I would mm -hmm. be happy. It is na. So, you like the item I gave you? That's why it's morairu, not morau. Like, because he's saying, if you were to receive happiness, <laughs> the, the <laughs> like of the things that I, I went to a specialty to prepare for you, I'd be pretty happy. Na. And he goes, konnani, which is like, what? This, this kind of thing? Watashi donna chatta no, which is, um, what, what happened to me? Oh my goodness. Da -da! Ah! Oh my goodness. 
But look, he, he prepared a nice little like house for you in there. It was, took so long. Nande uh, Gyorui, which is why am I a fish? And Archie, what does he say? Uh, <laughs> Yashiro wa yorokonderu. Like, are you happy? <laughs> yeah, it's like, she's happy, she's happy. Oh, you she love happy. your new little house. Jigao, you're wrong. And then what does he say? Itta daro daisho ga tomonau te. And like I told you, right? Exactly. Um, Dai so. We saw that way earlier. Um, Not today, but like in the book. Dai. Dai so. Oh, I'm liking so. so Daisho is like payment for something or compensation. Oh, right. Okay. And to, to, uh, Tomonao. Uh, Tomonao has not shown up before and it means to like a company. So it's mm -hmm. being used in here. Um, I told you, didn't I? And then he's quoting it, the te, that payment will come. <laughs> like, like I need to like. <laughs> Payment accompanies um, the getting help by uh, with mysterious things using a ghost power. We'll call it payment. And 